Hello everyone, welcome to Yellow Pages Nursing. In today's video, we will be discussing about drug calculation, how we convert units per hour to ml per hour. Now using the formula method, let's discuss the first example. Doctor's order is heparin, 1000 units per hour IV using infusion pump. Supply is 25,000 units heparin in 500 ml D5 water. What is the rate of infusion and how many hours will the IV run? The formula is desired dose multiplied by quantity divided by available dose equal to x. Here the desired dose is 1000 units, quantity is 500 ml, available dose is 25000 units. So applying all in the formula we get 1000 into 500 divided by 25000 which gives 20 ml per hour. So we said 20 ml per hour in the infusion pump. The next question is how many hours will the IV run? The formula is quantity in ml divided by number ml per hour which is equal to 500 divided by 20 which gives the answer 25 hours. One more example, doctor's order is regular insulin 15 units per hour IV using infusion pump. Supply is regular insulin 125 units in 250 ml NS. What is the rate of infusion? The formula is desired dose multiplied by quantity divided by available dose equal to x. Here the desired dose is 15 units, quantity is 250 ml, available dose is 125 units. Applying all in the formula, we get 15 multiplied by 250 divided by 125 which gives 30 ml per hour. And we set 30 ml per hour in the infusion pump. Now using ratio and proportion method, let's discuss the example. Doctor's order is heparin 1000 units per hour IV supply using infusion pump. Available solution of 25,000 units heparin in 500 ml D5 water. What is the rate of infusion? 500 ml contains 25,000 units. X ml contains 1000 units. So 500 is to 25,000 mg equal to x is to 1,000 mg. So 500 divided by 25,000 equal to x divided by 1,000. Cross multiplying each side we get 500 multiplied by 1,000 equal to x multiplied by 25,000. So x is equal to 500 multiplied by 1,000 divided by 25,000 equal to 20 ml per hour. So we set 20 ml per hour in the infusion pump. Using dimensional analysis method, let's discuss the example. Doctor's order is heparin 1000 units per hour IV supply infusion pump. Available solution of 25,000 units heparin in 500 ml D5 water. What is the rate of infusion? So we get 1000 units multiplied by 500 divided by 25,000 units and the units gets cancelled which gives 1000 multiplied by 500 divided by 25000 which is equal to 500 divided by 25 which gives the answer 20. So we set 20 ml per hour in the infusion pump. Here comes an example for your practice. Doctor's order is heparin 1200 units per hour IV supply using infusion pump. Available solution of 25000 units heparin in 500 ml D5 water. What is the rate of infusion and how many hours will the IV run? Using the formula method, ratio and proportion method and dimensional analysis method, you can do the calculation and mention the answers in the comment box. So here you go with the drug calculation, how we convert units per hour to ml per hour. If you find this video useful, please like it, share it and subscribe it and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.